we need to have some confidence with one another built in stability and reliance. Reliability from the supplier equals loyalty from the customer. And that is a foundation of a potential long-term partnership. Money is obviously an important metric to consider with any business deal. And when it comes to finances, transparency and setting expectation early are very key. So let's discuss that cost. Cost is obviously a driving force for anyone to determine if they're going to be adding any new brand to a program. So we want to negotiate and settle on this cost up front. And further, we want to determine if there's going to be an actual written contract in place or not. Is this a handshake deal, or will there be some written contracts in place? For me, as an operation, I always consider if that supplier actually has sizable cash flow to ensure that the project can come to fruition. I know that we're all in sales. We all want to make those big deals, but do not sell me anything that you cannot fulfill. So ensure that... One, that the product is there and that there's enough cash flow to actually ensure that the product can come to fruition. Payment terms are important to negotiate the payment structure up front. Who is going to be responsible for the carrying costs throughout the project? Will the operation, me, need to pay up front in entirety? Am I going to pay a deposit? Do I need to deposit 50% up front? Is there going to be a payment structure quarterly throughout the project? Will we be just paying as we go throughout the project upon delivery? Is there an option for financial advantage, such as financing, or any option for extended terms? Will there be an option for postponement of debt if a financial crisis hits, if any unexpected tariffs are thrown onto the project midway, God forbid, another pandemic hits? If there's anything that we've learned over the past couple years, it's important to have contingency plans in place for things that go awry. We are constantly pivoting in this industry, and this plays here as well. We need to have some confidence with one another built in stability and reliance. Reliability from the supplier equals loyalty from the customer, and that is a foundation of a potential long-term partnership. Not all on-premise employees are also familiar with the sales and supplier side of the industry, so just make sure that you're using transparency in all conversations. They, might, they may not understand that suppliers don't want to get stuck with privately labeled inventory if that operation cannot fulfill their end of the contract for one reason or another. They may not understand that the supplier would prefer that that product come off their books as fast as possible. So just ensure that both parties are on the same page early on, use that transparency, and this is going to help eliminate any problems or miscommunications about financial expectations going forward. <laughs>